There's a whole lot of booty shaking going on. Here's a look at the Zuru Pets Alive. This is Boppy, the booty shaking llama. This llama loves to dance. Meet Boppy, the booty shaking llama. She's got cool moves and can groove, dance, twirl, and shake her fluffy booty to three epic songs. So get up and bop with Boppy. Before we get this review underway, just in case somebody was wondering, perhaps, how big Boppy the Booty Shaking Llama is, I love saying that, we're going to go ahead and take the tape measure and just put it to the very top of her poofy hair. And let's stop it right, that seems, that seems like a good place right there. According to the Ultra Measuretron 5000, never thought I would be measuring a Booty Shaking Llama, but Boppy, height-wise, is 10.2 inches. That's not bad. Switching that over to the centimeters, let's do that post haste. You're looking at 26.1 centimeters tall. You know what? You know what? One other service I'm more than happy to oblige. I'm sure somebody is also going to be wondering how long she is. After all, if you're going to be getting yourself a little bed for Boppy, you want to also be able to know how long she is. So we're going to stop the tape measure right there as well. It's the least I could do. 10.1 inches lengthwise from the front to the back of her poofy tail and uh, that in centimeters works out to be 25.8 centimeters long. To come included with this zany llama you get yourself an instruction guide. It says I shake my booty and dance to three epic songs. Boppy the booty shaking llama basically just shows you how to change out the batteries. Owie wowie she does take four AA batteries so she does take a fair bit. But one good thing is that Zuru already include batteries, so you don't have to worry about buying those right away. You will require a screwdriver to unscrew the battery compartment. I'll show you where that is in a second. And then she does have the try and on button, and of course off. So we'll have a look at those right now. In fact, actually, if you grab the llama, sorry, Bobby, just hold on for one second. Tip her upside down. There is the battery compartment I was telling you about with the screw. Just want to unscrew that and that you'll get access to your four AA batteries. Like I said, the folks over at Zuru already include batteries, so you don't have to worry about that just yet. There is the off button, probably something that parents will be wanting to look forward to uh, the most. And then of course there's the try me button and the on button. If you switch it to try me, she does a whole lot less. When you switch it to on is where she'll cycle through the three different songs. And all songs are quite epic. We'll talk about that in a second. Before we do that, let's quickly have a look at this adorable little llama. Trying to think in the back of my mind, and though not much research has been spent investigating this, I can't think that there's been many instances where we've actually had llamas. Not even just talking about booty shaking llamas, but just llamas in general. I can't think of many instances where there's been a lot of llama toys. This could very well be the first. Somebody may very well correct me, and it's not the first, but I always find it interesting when they incorporate new animals uh, to, the, uh, to the aisles of the toys. So that's pretty cool. Uh, there's the on button right there. I know it just kind of looks like a musical patch, something which you would have won at the Boy Scouts, maybe for best uh, song, maybe your best songwriter, you would get a little patch to put with the rest of your other patches. But that is actually the activation button. I'm gonna be very careful that I don't press that too quickly because that's of course gonna go and cycle through the sounds and all that stuff. But uh, there's the sound effect. This is basically where you're gonna press that to turn on. Uh, the llama and uh, also too, I will also mention this to you as well. This is also where you can turn it off Though she doesn't cycle through a very long period of time when you have it on try when you do have it on on though It does some of the songs she does go through a, a little bit of time You can at any time turn that off by pressing this button again Again, don't, or I'll show you that in a second. On the front, she's got like a little tag, kind of a bit of a, uh, like a dog tag, kind of looks like a little bit of a poop emoji as well in the shape. You got Zuru Poop Pets Alive, and then on the back, you've got Boppy, the L booty shaking llama. I'd love to meet the person that came up with that name. That's, that's quite fun, Boppy, the booty shaking llama. There's Boppy's face. 
It does seem like she's a little loose than the neck. I can assure you there's nothing wrong with the llama. It's just the fact that she's going to get quite frantic once you press that button and the head's going to be moving and frolicking back and forth. She's got those softer ears and what almost looks to be like a mohawk. Um, I thought that it wasn't attached properly, but I think what it is is while she is moving her head, the hair is going to so frantically be moving back and forth as well. And that's likely why they haven't seamed it all in place. I think it's only stitched right in the middle, allowing the hair to move back and forth at its own free will. Uh, so that is the llama in a nutshell. A little uh, hooves, I suppose, done also in pink, kind of keeping to the white and pink motif, which is certainly something that my daughter would be all for. So let's... Let's get to try me, shall we, on the uh, booty, the bop, boppy, the booty shaking llama. I can't even say that right. We're going to go ahead and press the button right here. Now, keep in mind, this is going to be done in the try me mode. And then we're going to switch on over to the full on mode. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and press it. Let me just quickly double check and make sure. Okay, we, yes, we got it on try. Now let's go ahead and press the button. Now, again, this is only in try me mode. <laughs> Short, yes, but to give you enough of a sampling to know exactly what this llama does. I feel like her hair was just kind of going all over the place. Now, again, that is only on the try, so it's very short, and it'll only cycle through the one. If you switch it, however, to on, now you're going to get all the three different epic songs. And each of the songs will just be activated by pressing that button. Let me go ahead and do this, the first one, right now. Let's go ahead and press it. <laughs> uh, one thing I like is that the way that they've got it synced up, she moves her head and moves her tail to the music. You'll also notice too, sometimes while she is frantically moving her head and body around, it does kind of throw her off balance sometimes where she does fall over. Let's go ahead and cycle through the second song. <laughs> I also just did that right now so I could show you guys that you can again turn it off at any given point. It will still cycle through to now the third song, skipping over the second. Again, if you do find that particular song isn't your fancy or if you just want to stop it abruptly, you can go ahead and press that button again. And that's one thing I like when toy companies incorporate it. Sometimes you do have to sort of sit through the entire sequence and the entire song before the creature, in this case a llama, will eventually turn off. Here, Zuru were smart enough to incorporate the off button in the same place as the on, so that, again, if the llama's getting out of control, or maybe you stepped on in the middle of the night and you didn't want to wake up anybody in the room, you can immediately press it again to turn it off. That was the second song, and let's go ahead and press it for the third song. Here we go. I know you guys are excited. Here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> And that is the other song. Like I said, each one of them are unique, and she does do her own frantic dancing for each one of them. I kind of think that the first one is my favorite, and I'm going to go ahead and press that just so you guys can see once again. The only thing, again, that is... Uh, something that you have to be aware of is while boppy is bopping around sometimes again like you already saw a couple of times during this video she is known to falling over so you may want to just kind of pick her back up that will pretty much be on most surfaces uh, things like carpet might be a little bit more difficult because the carpet's a little bit more plush she may not get as much of a secure footing but overall a pretty fun llama all around and uh, pretty neat something of course not everyone is going to be you know, running to the stores to pick up. But I can tell you now, being a father, 
my daughter would love stuff like this and she's going to get an absolute blast out of playing with Boppy the Booty Shaking Llama. I will just get a blast for saying the name Boppy the Booty Shaking Llama. Kids are going to have an absolute blast booty shaking along with Boppy the Booty Shaking Llama. Still love saying that name. Parents, of course, will let on, pretend that they're a little too old to get interested in the kids' toys, but will chuckle, I'm sure, no doubt, on the couch as they're watching this llama shaking her booty across the floor, prompting minutes later for them to either pick it up themselves or ask the kid if they could see the toy because they want to hit the button as well. Don't worry, you're not the only one. I've done that at other people's houses as well. Boppy the Booty Shaking Llama, you can currently check out over on YouTube if you want to watch her dance on YouTube. And also, Boppy has the prestigious award of having the Australian Toy Association winner 2019 Toy of the Year and Electronic Toy of the Year as well. So that's pretty cool. If you are interested in picking up the Zuru Pets Alive Boppy the Booty Shaking Llama, it's a bit of a tongue twister, you should be able to now find it or find her at your local retail stores and toy stores alike. Today we were having a look, thanks to the folks over at Zuru, we were having a look at the Pets Alive, the brand new Pets Alive, Boppy the Booty Shaking Llama. I'm just going to get a t-shirt that says Booty Shaking Llama. Nobody's going to get the reference, I'll get the reference, and that's all that matters. My daughter will also get the reference. Uh, if you guys want to subscribe to this channel based on this review or maybe some of the other cool stuff that we've looked at on this channel and you're shy, maybe haven't gotten around to doing it, that's okay. Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. Swing on over next door. Booty shake your way over to that subscribe button and the bell notification. Thank you. And stay tuned because, of course, a whole bunch of videos are coming your way. Maybe like this. I don't know. Possibly. Très possible. Oh, Francais, un petit peu. Stay tuned, guys, because there's going to be a whole lot of videos coming your way. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.